I'm an engineer, definitely not a career politician. But I find myself standing as Labour's candidate for Mid Norfolk because I can no longer sit idly by. I'm standing because our children need the best possible start in life, and that means going to schools where there are enough teachers and where those teachers have the resources they need. I'm standing because our planning system needs to change so that new housing is planned with real improvements to our infrastructure and so that that infrastructure can be brought up to the standard it clearly should be. I'm standing because our social care services need to give us the care that we need when we need it and without the worry of losing our home or that after a lifetime of being careful and paying a mortgage we won't be able to leave a legacy for our children. I'm standing because Labour will improve things for all of us, not just for a privileged few. On Thursday, June the 8th, the people of this country will choose a local Member of Parliament and a Prime Minister. And I put it to the people of Mid-Norfolk that Theresa May, rather than Jeremy Corbyn, is the right person to lead this country through the Brexit negotiations and the difficult challenges we face here at home. Locally, I hope that people can see that over the last six years, I've shown a passion and a commitment to this area and I'm asking for a chance to see it through to continue my work on housing and planning so that we have small pockets of housing, not vast housing estates dumped on our villages, on health and social care, that we tackle loneliness and help elderly people out in our rural villages. And thirdly, schools and skills that we spread the opportunity here in East Anglia for everybody. Those are the causes I'm passionate about and I hope on Thursday you'll vote as well as nationally for a local MP who's committed to Mid-Norfolk. Thank you.